I think that it's important to keep in mind that bodybuilding is multifaceted. It isn't just the quest for the most massive man. It is a quest for the most perfect man. So that man is going to be a combination of classical symmetry, proportion, and mass, and ripped. And that is what I'm after, all, all of the above. I'm going to have a posing routine that's going to be even better than last year's, number one. Number two, I think you'll see my physique much improved, both in mass and quality this year. I think that Hunter is one of those uh, new breed of bodybuilders, next generation of bodybuilders that has the, the large muscle bellies, the complete symmetrical physique, but a small waist also. You know, so even though he's a big guy, he's not giving away anything, you know, in terms of his symmetry, you know, uh, the, uh, the big shoulder to waist differential. It's, uh, it's uh, very exciting uh, and it, it's going to be really cool to see how he does. is a man on a mission and uh, I've said it before but uh, he's he's very dangerous I think that uh, he is the most exciting new rookie IFBB pro bodybuilder on, on the scene today and I'm gonna make the prediction that if Hunter shows up in shape he wins By definition, to get your muscles to respond to training, you have to overload them. You have to you have to subject muscles to a stress that they are not capable of handling at that time, at that moment in time. And then what happens outside the gym 
but given enough rest, given the proper nutrition and, and such, then recovery takes place and the, the body adapts by putting on additional muscle tissue. It's almost like a mini evolution of sorts, you know, where the body reacts to stress in its environment, you know, by accumulating, by accreting more muscle. And so uh, uh, this, uh, by its very nature, is the, is the definition of that.